Well, hello, Cancer. It looks like family and friends have a few things to say to you about the relationship that you have chosen to be in. Let's dig in to see where this goes. Hello, everyone. Welcome in. This is a Cancer Tarot reading. It is a general reading usually between two energies. Let's dig in to see what sort of theme we have for you today. If you are interested in the extended to this video or in personal readings, there's links to both in the description box below. One cut, please. Thank you. That's a weird one, but we'll take it. Again, she keeps coming out. Everybody's putting away a really tough cycle. Number 37 reduces all the way down to a one, Silver Siren. And the other is Brilliant Virgin. Okay, I'll take it. Number five, number of change. I will take it. Okay. Silver Siren sings her song, A Pretty Poison to the Soul. Yep, her false allure tempts the mind even whilst the heart feels that something's not quite right. Your power will come from discerning the truth and allowing her false promises no place in your heart. So seeing through the illusion. Okay. For Brilliant Virgin, it says, In a world where we are bombarded daily with differing opinions and ideas, remaining true to you and your own point of view is nothing short of brilliant. Let go of confusion, distortion, comparison, and compromise. You do not need to compare yourself to another or measure up to anyone or anything else. What matters to you and your successful life journey is to be in touch with your own truths. You know what you feel, no matter what anyone else says or believes. Stay true to you. So what's going to help transition through and out of this cycle? I'm going to go here. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Show me what's going on with cancer, please. Okay. Time for some tough choices, I'm hearing. Okay, two of swords underneath. King of Pentacles, Taurus energy. Nine of Cups, Ace of Cups, Queen of Pentacles. King of Cups, Scorpio energy. Star, card of Aquarius, three of swords. I'm reading this is you, this is them, this is the situation. Okay. I feel like you finally found the one and other people have a problem with that. Mm. Hence the silver siren. Almost kind of like, um, the silver siren's almost kind of like, um, like family trauma kind of trying to suck you back in. Like, wait, you've never chosen someone like this before, Cancer. Why are you choosing someone like this now? It's like, because I grew the fuck up. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> you grow up, you make different choices, healthy choices, right? Um, and you're standing by your choice. Brilliant virgin, you're standing by your choice. You're, sh you're telling me that this is your wish. Okay. Um, it is kind of breaking this person's heart that you aren't being accepted for your choices by those who are supposed to accept you, like family and friends, for example. All right, show me the details of the King of Pentacles, please. Mother Star, Knight of Cups, Nine of Swords, Knight of Swords, Two of Cups. You knew, you knew leading up to this, this was going to be difficult. You knew leading up to this. Okay. Okay. So you have racked your brain and your heart 
for a bit. It could have messed up your sleep a bit, like almost kind of like you knew there was going to be a family dinner and it was time to bring them. And now every horror story potential outcome is like flooding your brain. Like, what if they say this about my partner? What if they say this? What if they... Da, 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 da. Ugh. I'd highly recommend not going to family dinner anymore. <laughs> Very easy for me to say. I understand. Okay. Let's get into the nine of cups. But this this is supposed to happen. This is mother star. This is supposed to happen. Okay. So it's either going to show you the truth of those around you and the new decisions you have to make from there. Who you can or cannot keep going forward. You know? And you have to stick to your guns. Show me the nine of cups for cancer, please. You don't want them to ruin anything. And you don't want it to cost you your relationship. Taurus energy with the Hierophant. <clears throat> For someone specifically, it's almost like, say like the, um, <clears throat> excuse me, say like the trend in your family is like the parents have saved up uh, money for their grown children. And if they don't use it for college, then they could use it for a down payment on the house. Just an idea. Okay. Just because it's showing me something allotted for you. Okay. And you knowing your family well enough that should they meet your partner, there's a possibility they may withhold that offer they've already given to their other children, for example. Do you get what I'm saying? Okay. Show me the queen of pentacles, please. Okay. This situation is like damn near making you feral. So whatever you need to do to calm the heck down, to take the edge off, go relax, get a massage, have sex with your partner, whatever it is, <laughs> whatever it is, we're all adults here, to take the edge off, do that, okay? Um, because you need to go into this situation as like even killed as you can, okay? So you're not reactive, because if you're this sensitive, you will be reactive, and that takes away your power. Show me the star, please. Wheel of Fortune, Three of Cups, Seven of Swords, Justice, Card of Libra. So the contrast that you're going to gain here is that, say, for example, if you're family who is not chosen you know you're stuck with them right your family may not like this person your friends are going to love them there's going to be some form of balance that you're going to discover in this one event i don't know if it's like a wedding that draws both family and friends to the table and you two are attending as guests so you run into everyone um but it's going to be very very clear that one group is like nah, and the other group is like, oh my gosh, we love your partner. They're so nice. Da, 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 kind of thing. So it, there's going to be balance achieved. Okay. 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 Get into this person. Show me the Ace of Cups, please. They're a little scared that it might not go well, but they're ready to be at your side. They want to be at your side. Capricorn, Aquarius, Cancer, Energy, Chariot, Star, Devil, Three Cups. It's kind of given that whole, alluding to the whole family event thing again. They want to be with you, be at your side. So I don't know if like, if you're not even engaged yet or married yet kind of thing, it's like you're now bringing them to sh family as like the next milestone of your commitment to further your commitment together. Um, they want it to go well too. Right. Okay. They, 
They want to be by your side. They may even want to drive. If you have to drive to get there, they want to drive you um, or handle that or handle that part transportation. Interesting. That's really specific. Okay. Um, and they, it looks like they're going to ask you to dance in front of everybody. Like if this is a wedding, they're, they're going to ask you for something that's going to draw attention to the two of you that where you could highlight your connection in front of others. Okay. Cause it, it's going to show you who's with you and who's against you. Show me the king of cups. And you need to know that going forward. Show me the king of cups, please, for them. Two of pentacles. Queen of wands, five of pentacles. Yeah, they don't want to lose you. They're happy to have you. They don't want to lose you. They don't want let to let anyone else cost them this connection. So they got it. They're motivated to make nice. To be polite, to make nice. Show me the three of swords, please. They keep comments that they overhear that you may not. They they keep those tucked away. They do hurt. It is cutting. Um, they can move forward from it fine. Taurus energy with the King of Pentacles. It could be a father figure. Okay. Um, or it could be a comment about the two of you furthering connection because King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. They manage. They don't show how much it hurts them. They move past it and keep going. Okay. How does this person feel about cancer? It's it's worth it's worth the struggle. So I don't know if like they want to continue giving to it generously. They know this is the long term thing, Taurus and Libra. They see you as their empress, okay? Um this person associates divine opportunity and challenging work as like the same thing as the possibility to result in the same thing, the same kind of blessing. So they're willing to put in the work for the blessing. Life has taught them if they complete the challenging work, then they will gain the blessing kind of thing. So they simply see this particular obstacle as that challenging work to complete in order to gain the blessing. Interesting. What's the deal with cancer's people? Queen of Cups, Knight of Wands, Moon. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay. Just the moon, please. Okay, so there is a emotional immaturity here that is ancestral, clearly, because it's not just one family member that has it. Um, there's emotional immaturity here that is ancestral. So they may keep it to themselves, but they are disappointed that you would take such a risk to be in such a connection. So I don't know if the two of you have opposing religions or anything like that. Um, that is seen as some sort of taboo by these people, by your family, with this narrow-minded kind of, you know. But um, they do shelve most of it, aside from this King of Pentacles who mutters something. Um, and they just kind of sit back and watch to see if it goes well for you. Leo energy, Leo Pisces energy. Interesting bunch. Show me about Cancer's friends. They see you're choosing love. They're learning a page out of your book. Oh. Temperance card of Sag, lover's card of Gemini. Got it. They learned 
in contrast to what they may know or practice when it comes to relationship, they learned that you waiting patiently for your one did end up paying off regardless of how challenging it was to wait. This is the result because they see that you're happy. They see that it's the lovers. They see that you're happy. Okay. See, oh, so cancer really waited and this is what they got. They got someone who really loves them. And now they're going to the next step in their relationship by bringing them to whatever this is, whatever event this is, family, dinner, wedding, whatever it is. Okay, they see that it's real, that it's love, that it's real. Wow. All righty. I'm going to head over the extended and get into your partner some more. I'm going to see what's going on with them in their current energy, near future, and the final outcome of the connection between each in this lifetime. I've got high hopes here. Oh, I'm going to see what's going on with them. Let's see, we'll do advice, messages between you, as well as timing. So if you're interested in any of that information, feel free to follow below with a link in the description box. And I'll see you guys over there. Bye. <laughs>